I'm Dan Melhouse. Brandy Melhouse. And we have three boys, Shane Melhouse, 11, Nathan, 6, and Caden, 3. We met in 1999, um, fell in love. And we, we started decided a to, yeah, family, family in 2002. Shane was born. Um, he was about five before we decided to have our second child, Nathan. And um, Shane, with everything with Shane, was typical. When Nathan was born, um, the beginning it looked like everything was fine. He was fine in the beginning. And as every milestone hit, he was late on everything. Late with crawling, late with sitting up, late with walking. I will love you. For someone like Nathan, who's high functioning, you don't typically get a diagnosis right away, and you're kind of confused for a while. So I think had he been significantly delayed in more areas, we would have gotten a diagnosis much sooner. We got his diagnosis December of last year, and he was already five. Take your bad days with your good. Walk through the storm. I was always in denial. You know, I thought it was just his behavior, he'll grow out of it. With Nathan in realizing um, that he was on the higher functioning side and now really what it meant, what all these delays meant, when we had Caden and I started to see some of the same things, then it really, that's when it really pushed us to try to figure it out because now we were gonna have two children and we were still quite lost. It's really difficult. You don't know where to go. And then when you do get in to see a doctor, you just kind of get a little piece of paper that has some recommendations on it, and then you're kind of sent off. We went to can -Do. That That's where they will actually connect those pieces for you. can -Do stands for the Center for Autism and Neurodevelopmental Disorders. We're really excited about it because in Metro West, Central Mass, and Western Mass, we really haven't had a clinic that serves multiple complex children and children with autism. Many ideas uh, come to me from clinicians and researchers on our campus. Uh, one of the best we've had uh, since I've been at the medical school was the creation of a clinic for children who uh, have autism. One in 50 children are being diagnosed along the autism spectrum. With additional resources, we can uh, we can actually make our clinic available to more families and children. We can uh, conduct groundbreaking research. We can establish partnerships with payers. And most importantly, we can make a big difference into, in the lives of children and the health of their families. People seek care from UMass Medicine for two reasons. They want the most advanced cutting edge care available to them when they're sick and when their family members are sick. And that's what they deserve and that's what they get from us. In addition, they want that care delivered in a compassionate, patient-centered way. They want that care delivered with heart. One of the great advantages that having the medical school and our relationship with the medical school gives the health system is that it allows us to attract world-class talent into the Worcester area. And the Can Do uh, Clinic is a perfect example of that. Together as UMass Medicine, uh, we can really make a difference in the lives of uh, families and, and children in our community. There was a day last year, I think in the spring, where it was the first day in his daily communication log that said he had a great day. And that was, that was huge. It almost seems like after he started, started the clinic, you know, they just were able to, to find him. You know, we were able to find him. You know, we, we would have moments at night when we'd have like a real conversation. We weren't able to find that before. With Can Do and just meeting the individuals that are part of that, you know that they're there because they want to be there. They're there because they believe. And there's no greater passion than that.